Tonight, eight alleged New York City gang members are now facing charges. They're accused of taking part in shootings and what investigators describe as sophisticated financial crimes. Among their victims, Uber and Lyft drivers. CBS 2's Dave Carlin has more. 21-year-old Aaron Heredio was escorted into a Manhattan courtroom to answer multiple charges in what prosecutors say was a wave of gang-related financial and violent crimes involving eight suspects described as members of the 2030 crew or 30 block connected to crimes including this infamous shootout. September 21st, bullets exchanged by members of rival gangs inside a Bronx car dealership. Three bullets struck this father, not an intended target, while he shielded his children with his body. Police say the same group of suspects knew guns and violence, but also sophisticated financial schemes. The gang activity that we're seeing in our counties is often intersected with an economic aspect of grand larceny and cybercrime. The cases against them unraveled with a single call to 911 from a rideshare driver. Police say the suspects would order Ubers or Lyfts, asking drivers to borrow their phones, then transferring money from the driver's accounts connected to apps and depositing it into their accounts. The goal is to make money and further their lifestyle and terrorize neighborhoods. Prosecutors say the financial and cyber crimes did not end there, alleging the gang members also took money intended for the needy in the pandemic. Their greed led to their undoing. When their identities were uncovered through the cashing of money orders at various post offices and other financial institutions. I will not let the Bronx be destroyed bullet by bullet. City, state, and federal investigators combined resources, prompting Commissioner Shea to call this bust precision policing at its finest. In Lower Manhattan, Dave Carlin, CBS 2 News.